family of Albuquerque bartender Steve Garrick is furious. One of the 16s charged in Garrick's death dodged a murder charge today in court after taking a plea deal for lesser charges. Action 7 News reporter Matt Howerton spoke exclusively with Garrick's widow this evening. He's at juvenile court for us. Matt. Yeah, Shelly, Garrick's family told us that that plea deal was a slap in the face. And as of today, three of the 16s charged in Garrick's murder have all taken plea deals for lesser charges. Today, for the third time, Vinnie Garrick saw one of the teen suspects accused of killing her husband dodge a murder charge. The process, the, the laws, disappointed, disgusted, distraught, depressed. Last year, Steve Garrick was shot and killed in his own driveway. Police say the beloved bartender fell victim to these 16s who were breaking into homes and cars. Chris Rodriguez, Jeremiah King, Ryan Archibek, Andrew Hubler, Matthew Baldonado, and Enrique Palomino were indicted on 40 charges, including murder. Today, Palomino joined the club. In juvenile court, he took a plea deal for charges of conspiracy, aggravated burglary, vehicle theft, and larceny. This is about a vital person who was shot down when all he was trying to do is his nightly chores. Garrick's widow feels like the justice system keeps failing her family, and her daughter agrees. As usual, the convict always wins. A judge will sentence Palomino next month. The maximum penalty he could get is staying locked up for the next five years until he turns 21. Garrick says it's a minor punishment for someone who took her husband. You think it's not enough for Steve? I don't think anything could ever be enough. And tomorrow morning there will be a hearing for Matthew Baldonado here at Juvenile Court. Sources tell us that a plea deal offering lesser charges could be given up to him as well. In Albuquerque, Matt Howerton, KOAT, Action 7 News.